Hello from the Bucket.io team. We're excited you're here. Regardless if you're a new or an existing user, our number one goal is to make sure you're a success using Bucket.io. Today marks day one of our week-long series, Five Days to Success with Bucket.io. These five days are dedicated to getting you started on the journey with our technology. In this video, we want to walk you through the basic setup of Bucket.io. When this video is over, you should be able to navigate the site more easily. Starting with the login page. The easiest way to get here is just to go to app.bucket.io, enter your email address, your password, and click sign in. The first screen you'll always see is your dashboard. And let's walk through the dashboard real quick. The top menu is the main menu that takes you through the whole site. You'll be able to get to your Discover surveys, your segmentation funnels, access your audiences, as well as make adjustments to your account settings, and of course, access our knowledge base through the help menu. You'll also notice there are three colored boxes on the screen. These are one-click access to creating new Discover surveys, creating a new segmentation funnel, or if you want to create a new audience, you do that from just clicking on each of these colored boxes. You also have instant access to the account performance statistics on your dashboard. These are set at zero, but as you get responses to your Discover surveys, through your segmentation funnels, these numbers will begin to populate, as well as with the graphical representation, which is a line graph on the bottom of the dashboard. Let's take a look at this icon at the bottom right. This is your direct access to our customer support team. When you click that icon, you'll have the ability to either create a new conversation, or if you have existing conversations, you can access those here as well. But you'll just click on the conversation and you'll have direct access to our support team. So let's go back up here and take a look at some of our menu items. Again, to create or access your Discover surveys, you'll click on the Discover menu item. This will take you to the Discover screen. Once you have Discover surveys, these will be populated here. Same with the segmentation funnels. Once you have segmentation funnels, you just click on Segment, and that'll take you to the segmentation screen. Audiences are the same, as well as your settings for your account. You can make adjustments to your billing information, add custom domains, and so on. To access our knowledge base, which will teach you how to use the different features of Bucket, simply click on help and you'll be taken to our knowledge base screen here. Let's take a look at an account with data actually populated. So as you can see here, you, the entire performance of the account is displayed as soon as you log in. You're also able to see a representation of how the growth has occurred in your account. That is how you get make your way through the Bucket.io app. In tomorrow's video, we're going to talk about actually creating your first Discover survey. So we'll see you then.